In this video, I'm going to show you how to draw a Pokemon ball on your TI-84 graphing calculator. Um, over here on the right hand side of the screen, I have all of the settings that you're going to need. Your window setting needs to be scaled to a negative 5, 5 on your x-axis and a negative 5, 5 on your y-axis. All right, you have several equations that need to be entered, and I've color coded these as to which color for which equation needs to be for when you put them in your color graphing calculator. All right, and you need to make sure that your axis are turned off. All right, now for the majority of these, um, I already have them set in the calculator, but we're going to go in and look and see where we get each one of those. If you click on the window button, all right, then the window comes up where you have to put in these window settings, and I already have those set in there. Um, if I want to turn the axis off, I need to do second format, and then that would be the fourth, fifth one there going down axis, and it is set to off because I want those off because I don't want to them to distract from the picture. All right, now each of these equations, there are six equations that need to be entered. When you go into your y equals button, to save time, I have already put the first four in. Um, these last two I'm going to demonstrate because unless you've ever worked with those inequalities, they're hard to locate on the calculator. Um, the color coding of this over here is where you can switch from red to black to any other color that you would want, but for the Pokeball, we want red and black. All right, so I'm going to arrow down and put in y sub 5 right there. So I'm going to enter a point 2, then I'm going to hit the divide by button. I want to make sure and do the parentheses. X is a variable. Now I need that less than right there. To get the uh, inequality symbols, you're going to do second test, and all of your inequalities will come up. I want less than, which is number 5, and then less than negative 1.2. All right, now to get the word or, you're still going to go into second test, but this time you're going to uh, arrow over to the logic menu because or is one of our logic conjunctions there. I'm going to pick a two. There's my or, and now I can finish that sentence out. X is greater than 1.2, so second test. Greater than is three there, and then 1.2, and you do have to be sure and close that set of parentheses. All right, and that line was supposed to be red. It's already set to red. So then I'm going to arrow down. I'm going to put that exact same line in, except I'm going to enter a negative in front of it. So negative 0.2, divide, left parentheses, x. Second test gets you to the inequalities. I want less than negative 1.2. I need the um, logic symbol for or, so that is second test arrow to the right for the logic menu and down to 2. X then is greater than, so greater than symbol, second test, greater than, and then 1.2 and be sure and close the parentheses. Alright, now everything should be set. The window was set, the equations are in, and the axes are turned off. So now we can go to the graph. And there you have it, your very own Pokemon ball. So definitely thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, give me a thumbs up and be sure and share with your friends. Thanks.